Welcome back to another video from Lord Gizmo. Today we'll be diving into the world of woodworking and seeing all the types of equipment used. If you enjoy this type of content, make sure to like the video and subscribe to see more like it. And if you write a comment when you do, we'll be sure to respond. First up, we have the Frontier OS-27. It is a portable mid-sized sawmill capable of processing logs up to 27 inches in diameter and producing boards up to 22 inches in width. It features a 13.5 horsepower engine that can be recoil or electric started. The sawmill is equipped with a revolutionary auto-locking saw head, an adjustable blade guidance system, a centrifugal clutch, and a rigid four-post carriage. Optional add-ons for this sawmill include a trailer system, a timber-loading winch, a tow board, and an automatic lubrication system. For those who want to mill their own lumber, the Frontier OS-27 sawmill offers a dependable and adaptable option. Next, we have the Sherwood 680C. It is an industrial saw milling machine designed for processing coniferous timber and transforming them into round sticks. It can produce high-quality lumber with consistent dimensions in a single feed. The machine weighs in at 1,984 pounds and has a power output of 7.5 horsepower. It can process logs up to 20 feet in length and 10 inches in diameter. It has a direct drive system design with an improved single O-ring seal, making it very reliable and long-lasting. It also features a unitized plug-style pressure relief device, or PRD for short, that protects the burst disc and allows for high flow rates. The Sherwood 680C is ideal for processing thin wood, and it makes stakes at an industrial level. Up next, we have the Raver WRC-1250AC. It's a horizontal bandsaw designed for use in high-output mills. Logs up to 49.2 inches in diameter and 49.2 inches in width are no problem for this saw machine. It can cut as much as 72 cubic yards in 8 hours and is powered by either a 45 or 55 kilowatt motor. Its blade is 9,045 mm long and 160 mm wide. The Raver WRC 1250AC has a pre-cutter that adapts to the contour of the log, a pushing board with a guiding hand, and a system for quick log handling. It also includes robust rails made of extra weld toughened steel, movable log turners, and reinforced support. And each roller is height adjustable. The machine also features pressured blade guidances with oil mist cooling, automated oil and grease lubrication, a tracking cutter, and a separate self-standing control panel with a seat and two joystick controls. Next comes the Mibor VTZ 1400 Plus. It is a vertical band sawmill system capable of cutting timbers with exceptional speed and accuracy. It has an impressive bandsaw head rig to cut logs up to 55 inches in diameter, both soft and hard wood. The log carriage is angled at 17 degrees so that boards can be readily received with their top faces up. There is a servo electric motor powering the carriage, and it can travel backward at a rate of 787 feet per minute. The servo motors adjust the head block separately for ideal log alignment and maximum wood recovery. The VTZ 1400 Plus has a low maintenance hydraulic power unit and it transfers excess energy between drives, making it an energy efficient machine. Up next is the Makina Takos Kisim. 
It is a manual wedge cutting machine designed for pallet production. It is made by Form Makina Sanayi, a Turkish company renowned for its pallet and wood processing machines. This wedge machine offers a max cutting capacity of 40 pieces per minute and can process wood up to approximately 4 by 6 inches in size. The equipment weighs 838 pounds, has a power output of 7 horsepower, and has a round saw with a diameter of 15.7 inches. The equipment is manually operated by supplying the material to the cutting blade. It is a basic machine for all pallet makers and is used globally. Next, we have the Wallenstein WP525. This firewood processor is a powerful and efficient machine that can process up to one quart of firewood per hour. It has a 20-ton splitting force and a 23-inch split opening that can handle logs up to 16 inches in diameter. It also features a winch and feed system that can pull logs up to 1,200 pounds and 50 feet long. The WP525 is towable and self-contained, with a 6.5 horsepower Vanguard engine and an 8-gallon hydraulic tank. The discharge chute height is 76 inches, which allows for easy loading of firewood into trucks or trailers. It can be used with any chainsaw with a bar length of 22 to 30 inches. Up next, we have the Albach Diamant 2000. It is a powerful and versatile self-propelled chipper that can produce high-quality wood chips from various materials. It has a permanent all-wheel drive system that allows it to navigate rough terrain and steep slopes. It is powered by a Volvo inline six-cylinder engine that delivers up to 768 horsepower. The chipper has a rotor that can adjust the size of the chips from 0.6 to 2.4 inches. The rotor also has interchangeable knife carriers that adapt to different shipping materials. The machine has road approval and a pneumatic differential lock for safe and smooth driving. The cab can be raised to get a better look at the chipping operation and the removal vehicles. Next comes the Black Splitter S1. This device is a hydraulic cone splitter that may be fitted to any mini excavator weighing less than 7 tons. The attachment can effectively split logs, firewood, stumps, and roots. It is also capable of chopping logs. It has a rotating cone that can handle all varieties of wood, including those that are twisted or knotted. With a diameter of 7.9 inches and a torque of 2,000 foot-pounds, the Black Splitter S1 is an amazing tool. It is manufactured in Germany combining components and engineering of the highest quality. Up next is the Harvester 500 series from Ecolog. These are world-class harvesters that use a unique pendulum arm technology to adapt to any terrain and provide exceptional ground clearance, reliability, serviceability, and productivity. They are powered by Volvo Penta engines that offer high performance, fuel efficiency, and low emissions. The 500 series includes five models with different characteristics and qualities to meet the varied needs of sustainable forestry. The smallest model is the 550T Pro, which is designed for thinning operations and weighs 38,580 pounds. The largest model, on the other hand, is the 688F, which challenges gravity with its balanced bogey and weighs 46,297 pounds. 
The cab of all these harvesters are able to rotate through 350 degrees, providing a higher level of comfort and visibility. Next, we have the West Bundelsäge. This machine can cut whole bundles of firewood from the ground to the desired length. It is designed to make the work easier, faster, and quieter. The machine can be attached to a front loader with a euro mount or a rear mount. It is driven by a hydraulic circuit with a minimum flow of 13.2 gallons per minute. The cutting length can be adjusted continuously up to 19.7 inches. The max wood length is 66.9 inches. The cutting speed is about 90 seconds, depending on the type of wood. It uses a bandsaw to make precise and clean cuts. The machine can load the cut wood onto a trailer up to 157.5 inches high. Up next, we have the Posh Auto Split. It is a log splitting machine that can produce kindling and firewood automatically and efficiently. It has two models, the Auto Split 250 and the Auto Split 375. The Auto Split 250 can process logs up to 10 inches in diameter and square timber up to 8 inches in diameter. The Auto Split 375 can process logs up to 14.5 inches in diameter and square timber up to 12 inches in diameter. Both models have an adjustable billet edge length from 0.8 to 6 inches, which determines the thickness of the wood pieces. The Auto Split 375 has a splitting power of 11 tons and a splitting cycle of about 5 seconds. It is capable of producing 100 sacks of wood per hour. The Posh Auto Split is driven by either an electric motor, a tractor, a combined drive, or a gasoline engine. Next, we have the Jet Jaws Dash S. This machine is an oscillating spindle sander. It can handle a variety of sanding tasks. It has a 1 horsepower motor that delivers 1720 RPM and 75 oscillations per minute, allowing for smooth and consistent results. The sander comes with 10 spindle assemblies and 5 rubber drums of different diameters, ranging from 1 quarter inch to 4 inches to suit different shapes and curves. The sander also features a large work table that measures 24 and a half by 24 and a half inches and can tilt 45 degrees front and 15 degrees back for beveling operations. The table has a 90 degree quick index for easy alignment and a four inch dust port for efficient dust collection. The sander has a cabinet in the base that provides convenient storage for the spindles and table inserts. Last but not least, we have the Pelink TRP. It is a pruner attachment that can prune vines up to 90% quicker than by hand. Its vision system monitors cordon and cuts vine shoots with high accuracy. It also boasts two horizontal and two lateral cutting modules, each with a respective diameter of 15.7 and 13.8 inches. The pruner unit can be paired with either a multi-vidi chassis or a Pelink carrier. It can operate day or night, regardless of the weather, and can manage dense vegetation. Additionally, it can prune close to the cordon for a uniform result and does not harm posts or trellis. All these features make it a perfect solution for vine cultivators who wish to save time, money, and labor while ensuring excellent pruning. Well, there you have it. We hope you enjoyed learning about these great machines. If you did, consider subscribing. We've got plenty of more machines that you can learn about. Just click here. And with that, we'll see you next time.